those marvelous motors will be in our country. Sorry to disappoint you, gentlemen. I don't think my government wants those motors to leave the United States. I right, turn you back. Head back to the mainland. You heard me back to land. Part of port. Drop her down to 10,000 feet. Consolidated Steamship Lines. Mr. Tracy, Mr. Vance. How do you do? How do you do, sir? And Captain Bullock of the Steamship Atlantis. Hello, Tracy. Captain? What's the trouble, Clive? A million dollars in gold has disappeared from the Atlantis. How? That's what we'd like to know. The gold was in a special compartment that was locked and sealed from the time the Atlantis left the other side until she docked here. When we went to open the compartment, the seal was just as we left it. But the gold was gone. You searched the ship? From stem to stern. And all luggage before it was allowed ashore. Is the Atlanta still in port? Yes. We had a slight accident at sea. A fishing smack rammed us. It's a matter of routine. We're having the plates examined in case any need repairing. Well, I'd like to go aboard and look the vessel over. Certainly. I'll notify the yard superintendent to be at your service. Thanks. Captain, did anything unusual occur during the trip? Yes. A seaman was lost overboard. At first, we thought it was an accident. But later, we found this in his locker. Remember, others will be watching to make sure that you obey instructions. This is no piker's job, Clive. In fact, it's big enough and clever enough to make me think. The spider ring? What are you going to do? Make sure of the handwriting on this note first. Then, well, good day, gentlemen. What did you find out about the note? Well, the handwriting does check with other notes. And it is from the spider ring. Mm -hmm. This handwriting. 
handwriting, Gwen. Gordon could have written that note. Oh, impossible. Gordon couldn't be the spider. Why? Why, the spider ring was operating before Gordon disappeared. That's right. For the moment, I... Hello, folks. I just heard about the missing gold shipment. Dick and hurried right over. What's the note? Well, I'm going down to the dock and look over the ship. You better stick around here. Okay. Well, say, Chief, you better take me with you. I'm a human bloodhound when it comes to getting gold. <laughs> All right, Mike. Oh, Gwen, you better file this away with the rest of them. You better go get your hat on. Hurry up, huh? Everything is ready. Here's the working diagram of the Atlantis. This is where our ship rammed her. That uh, accident was a very brilliant inspiration, though. And the goal? Here, near the bow, where we can get to it when we are ready. I'm the superintendent. I'm the superintendent. Oh, Mr. Stevens. My name is Dick Tracy. Oh, yes. Mr. Vance told me you'd be here. What can I do for you? Well, I'd like to have a little look around, if you don't mind. Why, sure. Come along. Thanks. Junior, you know in some localities I'm known as not tying McGurk. Really, I'm one of the finest rope tires that you've ever seen. Have you found any damage? Some. One plate seems to have been strung a bit. I'll show you. Could it have been done deliberately? Well, it could. But I don't see what good that would have done anybody. Where was she hit? Just aft of a midships. Now, here's the plate that was sprung. Now, there I go, spilling ink all over again. Now, I guess I'll have to get a new pen. <laughs> Here, take mine. Oh, thank you. Now, here's where she got rammed. And there's where the gold compartment is. Quite a distance apart, you see. Hmm. Have you fixed the plate yet? No. The riveting crew will take charge of that when they get here. Want me to show you the ship before I go? Before you go? Yes. My foreman Clancy bosses the riveters. Come along. Thank you. It looks solid. It is solid. There's nothing wrong with it. I've tried it in Indochina. And What's the gag, Mike? Oh, I was just showing Junior a little rope trick I had here. High class. <laughs> now, you take the two ends, see, and you put one on each wrist like this. Now, pull them tight. And I mean, that's it. Pull them good and tight. Dick Tracy, the G-man, just came aboard. He's making a complete inspection of the ship. Better notify the lame one. Calling to location seven. Calling to location seven. Calling to location seven. Location seven answering. Stand by. I'll take it. Tracy just came aboard. He's making complete inspection of the boat. I'm leaving at once for the dry dock. Want me to cut it? Oh, you don't think I can get out of it, huh? Me, what sail the 11 C. Well, I'll fix it this way.
Well, there isn't much I can tell you, Mr. Tracy, except that this is the vault where the gold was stored. Well, I'd like to take a look inside. Go as far as you like. Clancy will cooperate with you. Glad to have met you. Thank you. Thank you very much. See? There's a G-man aboard. G-man? Yeah. I don't know what he wants, but do all you can to help him out, will you? Yeah. find this fellow Clancy? Yeah, that's me. Oh, I see. You have the blueprints. Are you going to fix that damaged uh, plate? Uh, yes, yes. I was just starting to do it. Well, do you mind if I tag along? No. Suit yourself. Barley, I've already marked the plate. Cut it according to this blueprint. All right, boss. So that's where the damage plate is. Sure. Where'd you think it was? I was just wondering. Thanks. Well. What's the matter with you, Mark? You afraid of burning them rivets? Can I see that blueprint for a minute? I suppose you're going to try to tell me my business. No, I'm just a curious sort of a guy. Remember, be ready when they remove that plate. That's all you can do from in here. Take the equipment outside, start cutting from there. What's that? Blueprint showing where the damage plate is. I thought it was more amidships. How do they make those? White ink? Ink. There was an ink spot on Stephen's copy. I loaned you my pen. This isn't the right blueprint, Junior. You wait here for me. Mind your own business, could you, Copper? Oh, Junior? Are you sure? I saw it. The man hit him. We'll be right down, Junior. What's the matter? Dixon's over at the shipyards. Call headquarters and ask him to send help. Main, 4-100. 